from Germany to Appleton. That is the distance it took for a bone marrow match. The, the donation helped save a child's life three years ago, but it wasn't until this week the donor and recipient met for the first time. New at 5, Nolan Blair shows us the strong connection the two share. 18-year-old Jordan Van Strum has been on a journey filled with ups and downs. He's had a cancerous brain tumor and leukemia. Family and friends, though, were always there for him. Including Marco and his family. It's just, to be honest, it's been pretty easy. That's Marco Brodkar from Germany. He gave Van Strum his bone marrow three years ago that helped him survive after being matched through an organization called DKMS. I only gave him the missing part of a puzzle, what he needed. More than 4,000 miles traveled, and Brodkar met Van Strom for the first time this week, a special moment during a week filled with fun, with Brodkar getting to fulfill a dream with a Wisconsin company. And that dream was fulfilled when he visited the Harley-Davidson shop here in Grand Chute. To be here in the United States and not at a touristic um, station, so um, driving Harley here and just feeling the wind going through my face. I think that's a, it's a dream of many people. And, and the group continues to spread word about becoming registered as a potential donor with DKMS, highlighting that 75% of the National Bone Marrow Registry are white, making it difficult for minorities to find matches. Giving somebody else a second chance, and that's, to me, I, I can't see much that's a lot better than giving somebody life. Van Strom hopes to turn his experience into a career in medicine. In Grand Shoot, Nolan Blair, Action 2 News. Connection for life. That was a win-win for everybody. <laughs>